from his misery? That's my question. Fuck! <laughs> fuck! Dude, the way you yelled fuck. Yeah. Fuck! <laughs> Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today, I'm going to be talking about doxing and DDoSing, okay? These are two things that happen to me pretty frequently, okay? So I've gone pretty much accustomed to it. It's religious to me at this point. Usually when I join a Discord server or some kind of chat of any kind, I usually get fucking doxed or DDoSed or something like that. And I've been DDoSed a half a billion times. I've had pizza and, and fucking hot wings sent to my house. You know, I, I've had been hit offline and shit, so it's just like I'm used to it. And... Uh, when I say that, I'm not saying like, oh yeah, just an average day on the fucking job. Just an average day of getting my fucking house bombed by Kim Jong-un. No, okay, I'm talking like, I literally join a Discord server, and then I get DDoS. <laughs> like, I'm not fucking kidding. Like, this literally happened to me a couple days ago. I joined this, and, you know, I'm not even, I'm gonna be honest as fuck with you, okay? Real shit, buck fifty, here we go. I used to be a brony, okay, I used to like the MLP shit, I never watched the show, but like I kind of liked the community, it was pretty cool, uh, but I'm not really into it now, that was like more than a couple of years ago, and basically, there was this YouTube channel that I knew about, um, that I subscribed to and watched from, you know, like every fucking day, but uh, I kind of forgot about it after a while, and that was like three, four years ago, okay, and uh, I just recently rediscovered it, and I was like, oh shit, I remember these guys, and so I realized they had a Discord server, so I was like, fuck it, let's join the server. And, you know, instantly as I joined, there was like 20 fucking, like, there was a shit ton of people in this VC chat, right? So I was like, fuck it, let's join the VC and see what happens. So I joined the VC, and there's just, like, people are talking and shit, but as soon as I get in there, everybody's like, yo, that guy right there, he's new. He's new, guys, he's new, let's fucking get him. <laughs> and basically, not even, not even a minute of me being in that voice call, there was already some dude reading off my location. I'm not fucking with you. Like, he didn't, he, I mean, he didn't start off all crazy and shit, right? He said California, right? Which is the state that I live in, you know? But I mean, anybody honestly could have pulled that out of their ass and just made it sound scary. Uh, but dude, I mean, then he said my fucking whole, my town. And I was like, oh shit, I gotta go. <laughs> you know, I'm like, I'm so used to it at that point. I was like, it was instinct. Like, it, this shit is so religious to the point where I automatically was clicking like the the leave server button like all oh, like instantly bro I was like shit I gotta go <laughs> and you know what for the most part that was it but it wasn't over what happened next maybe like for the next five to ten minutes there was just non-stop people like trying to friend me right because I had my shit on safety like as soon as I left that server I went into my settings and like I, I basically made it to where nobody is allowed to message me not even my friends or something like that and there were people that were trying to like you know like friend me so that they can like dox me or some shit or, or like fuck with me and uh well you know naturally i blocked every single person that tried to friend me because that's that's the safe thing to do you know when somebody's trying to fucking dox you or trying to get information about you you gotta you gotta block them you have to distance yourself as much as you can from these people because they will do everything in their power to fuck with you as much as possible right and i mean most of it the 90 percent of this whole entire encounter has everything to do with, you know, the reaction that you give. If you're just like, oh shit, gotta go, like me, right? And you leave the server and block everybody that tries to get into you, then nothing's gonna happen and nothing did happen. But like, if you stay in the voice call and you're like, yo, how did you get that? Dude, dude, chill, dude, stop, stop, stop. Then they're gonna continue to fuck with you. They're gonna try to go deeper, bro. Just a little bit of advice for anybody that has never been doxxed or has been doxxed before. Don't fucking overreact, okay? Don't react to it at all. Just literally leave. Like, that's all you need to do. Um, and in terms of doxing or DDoSing, I've been DDoSed half a billion fucking times over. I got DDoSed on New Year's Eve of 2018. It was so funny. Literally, as, to, as soon as the clock struck 12, I got DDoSed. Somebody, some fucking faggot with a booter hit me offline. It was literally like, I bought an Xbox 360 to relieve some, to relive some, like, nostalgia, right? And I bought a few games, right? And... I turn this thing on, I, I pop in Call of Duty Black Ops 2 for the first time in like six years. And instantly I join this like search and destroy lobby, not even a minute of being there. There's already some guy that's like inviting me to a party with it, where it's just him and he's reading off a bunch of numbers and I'm like, what the hell? And instantly I knew, I was like, oh fuck, that's my IP and I left and then I got disconnected from Xbox Live. And next thing I know, all I hear from downstairs is just my dad yelling, what the fuck? because we got fucking hit offline. 
And, uh, well, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it for this video. I didn't want to make it too long and crazy. Just a little bit of advice for you guys. If you get hit offline, then just call your fucking ISP or something or try to get it figured out. Like, like unplug your router and replug it back in. Because getting hit offline isn't nearly, like, as bad as what most things people can do to you, which... There's a lot of shit, like, people can, like, dude, they can fuck, like, there's dudes that legit can hack into the fucking CIA, dude, and, like, recover, like, the fucking anal probing documents where these aliens, like, shove fucking metal shards up our assholes, bro. <laughs> shit is fucked, bro. But, yeah, anyway, that's it for this video. Uh, be prepared for the next video that's coming in about three months uh, when I come back and upload videos for another week and then leave again. Um, it's gonna be great, man. I think I'm gonna make some pretty good videos. And uh, if you liked the video, leave a like. If you disliked the video, then leave a like and subscribe. Subscribe or else I'm going to hit you the fuck offline.